she dwells by great Kinawa's side, in valleys green and cool, and all her hope and all her pride are in the village school her soul, like the transparent air that robes the hills above, though not of earth, encircles there all things with arms of love and thus she walks among her girls with grace and mild rebukes, subduing in rude village churls by her angelic looks she reads to them at even died of one who came to save to cast the captive's chains aside and liberate the slave and oft the blessed time foretells when all men shall be free and musical as silver bells their falling chains shall be in following her beloved lord in decent poverty she makes her life one sweet record and deed of charity for she was rich and gave up all to break the iron bands of those who waited in her hall and labored in her lands long since beyond the southern sea their outbound cells have sped, while she, in meek humility, now earns her daily bread. It is their prayers, which never cease, that clothe her with such grace, their blessing is the light of peace that shines upon her face.